What's up guys, Shahbaz here. So, according to the latest news, the new Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra will be a super perfect smartphone for gaming. According to the news, the new Galaxy S23 Ultra comes with an overclocked graphics accelerator machine. We have already explained that the Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra will have an exclusively overclocked SoC, mounting a particularly high-performance variant of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 processor. Initially, it was thought that overclocking the chip would be only affect the CPU. But today we find out that the GPU of the SoC will also be improved. This was confirmed by the well-known insider IEC Universe, who explained on Twitter that the special edition of Samsung Snapdragon 8 Gen 2, whose official name we still don't know, will have a CPU with a clocked increase from 3.2 GHz to 3.36 GHz. The GPU will have an increased frequency from 680 MHz to 719 MHz. The data to which the leaker refers should be related to Qualcomm's Adreno 740 GPU, introduced precisely with the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2. If on other smartphones, the integrated graphics will run at 680 MHz. On the top of the Samsung range, it will have a frequency equal to 719 MHz. For the moment, unfortunately, it is not clear whether the GPU clock increase will be exclusive to the Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra or whether it will be also be extended to the Samsung Galaxy S23 and Galaxy S23 Plus models. In any case, it seems that the new Samsung smartphones will be the best for gaming on Android operating system, at least for the first months of 2023. The same Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 has been optimized for video games on the go. Thanks to support for ray tracing and for Unreal Engine 5, Samsung's version of the chip, therefore, should soar above those reserved for competitors, smartphones in terms of performance, guaranteeing more solid in-game frame rates and high stability even for the heaviest software. Some, however, raise concern about the temperatures of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2, which with a further increase in CPU and GPU frequency, like the one decided by Samsung, could cause overheating problems on the smartphone already in 2022. However, Samsung measured itself with the overheating problems of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1, so it is unlikely that a similar situation will repeat itself a year later. The phone is rumored to have the same 6.8 inches display and a 5000 mAh battery, but will be powered by the Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 chipset and may have featured a new front-facing camera. There is also a chance that it will be more expensive than the Galaxy S22 Ultra model. The Galaxy S23 Ultra is supposed to be announced as part of Samsung Galaxy S23 series early next year, but we won't have to wait long before the next big development lands in our hands. That's it for now. For more updates, please subscribe to our channel Science and Knowledge. Until the next video, take care of yourself very well. Peace out.